three years after the start of the Arab Spring on the 26th of January 2014. Tunisian members of parliament adopted a new constitution. Article 1 was the same as that of the previous constitution, which dates from 1959. Tunisia is a free, independent, sovereign state. Its religion is Islam, its language Arabic, and its system is republican. The text combines secularism and Islam, and for the first time in an Arab country, the constitution guarantees the freedom of belief and conscience and the free exercise of religion. Sharia isn't mentioned as part of the law. However, eight years later, Kai Said is now proposing a very different project. His objective is to give the head of state a source of uncontestable power, allowing for immunity throughout the duration of their mandate. The new constitution also considerably reduces the role and power of parliament and looks to put in place a second chamber, the National Assembly of Regions, created on the model of the French and American Senates. However, one of the most contentious points concerns the place of Islam. Article 5 of the presidential project states that Tunisia is part of the Islamic Ummah within a democratic system. Only the state will have to watch over and guarantee the objectives of Islam. This has been criticised by those in favour of the separation of religion and state.